Hey everyone, how you doing? Um, so this week I'm still in New York and um, it's kind of like a work on my own kind of thing this week. Um, I'm working on some gigs that I'm going to do coming up and I'm also starting on Swan Lake. I know it sounds crazy, but um, I just want to get something started. Like I'm starting to do Black Swan since I haven't done it since January of 2011. I figured I'd better start getting my body sooner rather than later. So I'm going to show you some of that. And then um, I'm going to talk about recovery stuff. You know, it's a year since I was injured with my back. And, you know, I just want to tell you guys some recovery tips and what really helped me um, get me back. And um, so I hope that's good. I hope everybody's good. And I will see you in a minute. So I wanted to show you, um, you see this massive bed right here? It's my bed. But I just want to tell you that this is one of the main things that I did last year after I got injured, is I got a new bed. And it is a Tempur-Pedic bed. And you see how thick the mattress is? Let me show you. Look at that. It's really, and this is also Tempur-Pedic. It's like the base, because they're very, very heavy. But they're like really really tough and that's what I needed for my back um, make sure that you have a really really great bed and I really recommend Tempur-Pedic because they're so nice to sleep on and there's so many different kinds you can get um, just have to go to the store and lay on top of them and see what you like so definitely go do that another thing that I found a huge part of my recovery is um, having a personal life and I've still kept it up till this day and meaning going to theater, going to see dance, going to see music, going to see all these things and I know that you're pretty exhausted at the end of the day after your rehearsals and everything but I always, I really make myself go and see these things because it will only further me as an artist and balance me out at the end of the day. I mean and make me kind of stop thinking about what I was doing all day long. It's kind of like it shuts it off. And I just wanted to show you all the programs that I have from like this past week. It's kind of crazy. Look. Look at all those programs. It's like six programs. Plus, you see this catfish? I was, I was in the studio audience of Catfish this past uh, weekend. Um, my best friend, Neve, Showman is the main guy of Catfish. And uh, he invited me to the studio audience. Boy, man, it was a long, long night, but it was really, really fun. And I think it, the one I'm going to be in airs uh, next week on Tuesday. So I'm really going to watch out for that. It's really cool. I also wanted to show you that there's this new book out um, on Balanchine. It's called Balanchine and the Lost Muse. Um, it's brand new. I just got it um, loaned to me by one of my dear friends, and I'm going to read it on my um, travels coming up. So make sure you check this out. It's, you know, it's back 
way before he came to America when he was still in Russia, and it's supposedly about the first person that he ever danced with when he was very, very young. Um, and I'm very, very interested to see what it's about. So definitely check it out on Amazon.com and read it. I am about to pack um, for a little weekend getaway. Um, and I wanted to show you these new shoes I got. They are from Cole Haan. Um, they're suede. And they're, of course, light purple on the bottom. But what's really amazing about these shoes is that the bottom is Nike Air. I don't know if you can't see it anywhere on here, but they're Nike, and they're really, really light, and it's very, very comfortable inside and supports your feet, and that's something that's a huge thing for me. I mean, I do wear heels. Don't get me wrong. I love my heels, but when I've got feet problems, when my back is hurting me, you've got to have some comfortable shoes on, and these raggedy old things these glitter sneakers inside of these i have orthotics that were made for me and that's why i love wearing them um obviously i can take the orthotics out and put them in any kind of shoe but i think it's a huge huge thing to have orthotics made for you because that's what you're supposed to be walking on um so maybe go to your doctor or you can even go to the simple drugstore and get them made for your for your feet they're really really great so I'm off to the theater now, um, it's Thursday night, and I will see you guys next week. Um, I'm having to learn a lot of new ballets for these gigs that I'm doing coming up. I'm going to Spain and then I'm going to Venice. So uh, next week I'm having to learn that stuff and maybe I can talk you through what it's like to learn a completely new ballet and the, some tips I can give you and some advice and all that stuff. Alright, have a great week guys, bye!